Hey guys, Julian here and today I'm with my model Poet and we're on location doing a little bit of a fun collaborative sort of shoot. Um, this shoot came about because we both decided we just wanted to shoot at this particular location. It's got that little bit of a European Tuscan sort of vibe to it. So we've got uh, a stylist on board, Bronte. I'll link everybody in the description below and uh, leave their Instagram handles so you can check them out. And she's come up with a few looks for us to shoot today. So um, let's get started. We'll see when the sun comes out, but maybe sort of up against this wall here. Um, and yeah, beautiful. Just forward to me a little more. Yeah, that's it. Perfect. Okay. Just take a couple to get all my settings right. Beautiful. Let's have a quick look at these. Make sure the lights. Love that angle. Well, this works really well. Colours look beautiful. Okay. All right. Great. Yeah, this is just waist up. Beautiful. That's lovely. Oh, that car. Great. Okay, let's do a few full body shots now. Yeah, beautiful. Great. Beautiful. Beautiful. I think we got this. So in general, uh, you probably noticed that I shoot through the viewfinder as opposed to the um, LCD screen on the back. But one of the things you may see me do a little bit is that to frame up a shot or to see if I like the composition, the perspective, um, or even just the, the frame in general, I do use the LCD for like my first shot of a little set. So I'll, um, I'll open up the LCD, I'll have a look through, I'll frame up my model. I'll even sometimes adjust the, the exposure and then take one shot if I like that. And we're gonna continue in that location, that position, that composition. Then I'll switch it back to the viewfinder and I'll shoot from there. Oh wow. Oh, amazing. Have a look at this. Oh, that's <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, beautiful. Great. Beautiful. Great. Beautiful. Great. Beautiful. Oh, I really like that looking down again for me. Beautiful. Hold well on. Uh, yeah, let's give that a try. Actually, hold that for me. Let's let's see. Uh, ooh, oh, this is nice. Cool. Uh, did you bring one down? You did, didn't you? Oh, it's good. Yeah. Bit of wind. It's 
nice. God, this dress looks good no matter what you do. You're not going to want to give this one back, eh? Oh my God. <laughs> Really nice light on your hair now too. Beautiful. Great. Great. Just leaning forward again to me. Yeah, that's it. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, they're great. Yeah, great. Oh, sun. That's really good. Oh, yeah, look at that. Wow. Beautiful. I really like that sort of looking down again and letting your hair hang out. Yeah, perfect. Beautiful. And let me just take a little landscape. Got it. Beautiful. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Cool. Um, shall we... You want to do your, the next look? Yeah, let's do it. So we've just finished up shooting our first look and while Poet has gone to change, I thought I'd uh, let you guys know what I'm shooting on today for those that are interested. I'm shooting on my old workhorse, it's the 5D Mark IV um, with the 24 to 72.8 lens. This is my favourite uh, lens to shoot uh, fashion on. Um, I like the fact that you can sort of zoom in and out and when you're zooming out to that kind of 24 mil, it starts distorting limbs and things like that, giving a little bit more length to the body and, and um, just making a few more interesting angles. So I think uh, Poet's ready to go, so we'll get stuck into the second look. So you can see in the background here, Bronte and Poet just putting the finishing touches on this look. This is the look that I originally got a little bit of inspiration from when I saw this location. Um, you can see on the screen now, uh, just a screenshot that I found on Pinterest, uh, which kind of started the concept of this whole shoot. Beautiful. Can you take a big step this way for me, please? Thank you. And yeah, okay. Just go some half body now. Yeah, great. Cool. Yeah, beautiful. Let's do a few with this uh, wall. Maybe front on we can might do nice? this way okay. and then you can hold it in front of you like that if that, yeah, beautiful. That's cool. Yeah, cool. Just um, come like a meter towards me. Yeah, that's it, right there. Perfect. Beautiful. Yeah, really beautiful. Great. Wow. 
amazing. Beautiful, hold that. Great. And if you're just not leaning on it, just standing there for me, yeah, perfect. So we're just switching up locations and there's this really big, beautiful tree behind and the light is filtering through the leaves really nicely. So I'm going to go with a little bit more of a portrait approach as opposed to a fashion approach. So I'm just changing to the 50 mil lens um, and I'm going to go with a little bit more of a shallow depth of field just to really accentuate that bokeh and get those beautiful little soft light coming through the background of the leaves. Um. Beautiful. It's going to make for some great YouTube audio. <laughs> Beautiful, hold that for me. Yeah, great. Lovely. Cool, let me just have a quick, oh, let's have a quick look at these. Oh, sick. Make sure they're nice and sharp. Beautiful. Yeah. Um, no, that's nice. Yeah, beautiful. Oh. Sorry, yeah. Wow, that does so much. Can I see it with the white? Yeah. I generally prefer the white, but yeah, I think I like the white. Let me. But. So that's white, silver. I, I think white, still, white looks a bit more natural, a bit softer. I like the white. Um, we're just going to go, yep, yeah, they're up. No, you're good. Yep, yeah, beautiful. Great. Beautiful. Thanks, Paul. So that's it, guys. Two looks in the one location. We shot for about an hour and a half, two hours. Uh, we shot a little bit of film as well, so I'm looking forward to getting those developed. Uh, that's always exciting, waiting for a roll of film to come back. I uh, hope you enjoyed the behind the scenes. Big thanks to Poet for modeling Bronte for Styling and Paul behind the camera shooting some BTS. So if you enjoyed this little behind the scenes of our shoot here, help me out with a like, a subscribe, and as always, thank you for pressing play.